I was smiling sometimes, like it feels like you can never really switch off with my brain. I'm going to go to bed. I've got my sneakers, so I'm happy to get out. Hello guys, welcome to a new weekly vlog. This is not usually the time that I start a vlog because it is Tuesday at 8 p.m. Truth be told, I didn't vlog yesterday. I wasn't really in the best mood. I was really just a bit bleh, but it's fine. I woke up feeling much better today after taking some time to myself and watching like the bold type all night and watching YouTube and just kind of clocking off work. Aww. <laughs> um, and then today I just did coaching calls. I think I had like 10 calls today. So obviously that is not that interesting to film because I can't really film my calls with people. And then I also got this new set from right away. You can't even really tell. There we go. But I am obsessed with the color and it was my motivation to go to the gym tonight. Didn't film anything, but I did triceps, chest and shoulders. If you follow me on Instagram, I posted my workout. So you can go ahead and screenshot that if you like. But now... We are just cooking dinner, and of course, Andy. Missed. <laughs> Can you get that for me? No, I'm not touching it. Andy is the, the chicken master in this household. I hate cutting raw chicken. Like, there's just something about it that just grosses me out, and if I do ever have to do it, I end up cutting off a lot and just wasting it. So Andy is usually the one who cuts up the chicken in our household, and you have done for like seven years living together. Isn't that crazy to think? Like, I've probably cut like five chicken breasts in my whole life. Yeah. It's so bad. <coughs> Luckily, he's the best. So yeah, we are making teriyaki chicken balls for dinner. And I thought, why not just start the vlog now? YOLO. Every single vlog, Oreo just meows. Meow, meow. Wednesday guys I am just about to make my lunch for today I actually already meal prepped on Monday but again because I didn't actually vlog on Monday I didn't show you but I'm about to roast up some veggies in the air fryer which I chopped up on Monday so I have sweet potato white potato um, and pumpkin although I'm slightly regretting cutting it up on Monday is this gonna be weird now I feel like I should have just left them whole it kind of looks like it's moist, if I can use that term. Let me open. Oh, I hope I didn't waste it. What? How annoying. I feel like it should be right. Maybe I'll Google it if it's safe to roast veggies that are already cut up. Surely it would be. Surely. It's a vegetable. Fingers crossed, but I'm just going to pop them in the air fryer. And I also have some roast chicken that I bought on the weekend leftover. So I'm just gonna heat that up with some gravy and that is gonna be my lunch and I'm very excited. Andy's dragging me to the supermarket to get strepsils and all I want was Snickers like we just went to the gym I'm probably gonna get copy right now with the music over this but I've got my Snickers so I'm a happy gal <laughs> wow <laughs> Sorry. who knew it would take so long to find strepsils well, I found them we found them but how so long does one... it take to decide we well, got options so it's you could be here all day <laughs> I feel like it's what I said, like honey, 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 honey. <laughs> honey and lemon. It is sold. Like sold. Put it back. Put it back. <laughs> sold. Is there anything more adorable than when cats need on blankets? Like, you, sir, are so freaking cute, even though you meow all day long and annoy me. 
You're also adorable. Anywho, it is now Thursday. I just actually, <laughs> the tail. <laughs> I actually just finished filming a YouTube video and it was a reacting to my old what I ate today's and I just, I don't know if this, if that video will be up before or after this video, but if you have not seen it yet, please go watch it because it was definitely a goodie, but also definitely a big eye opener because I just can't believe how restrictive I used to be. And there was like one sentence in one of the videos that said basically like, sorry guys, I don't usually eat sweet, uh, I don't usually eat white potato, but it's all I had left. And I'm just like mind blown that that's how my brain used to think. So Anyway, it was an interesting video to film. So it's now lunchtime. I'm about to put on some food and then I have calls from one o'clock till 6.30 p.m. today. So lots of calls, but I'm excited. I love hearing their feedback, how they're going, their progress and things like that. It makes me so happy. But yeah, that is pretty much what I'll be doing for the rest of the day. <laughs> it's so cute. It is six o'clock guys, and I am logging in to menu log right now because I'm starving and I'm just in the mood for Chinese. Like when was the last time I ordered Chinese? Probably months and months ago. Like it's been a long time. So I'm on the menu log app and I'm gonna order Uber Eats. I'm, I'm on the menu log app and I'm gonna order <laughs> Uber Eats. <laughs> Who are you? <laughs> I'm on the menu log app and I'm gonna order some takeaway, which very random for a Thursday Arvo. Usually we mostly get takeaways on weekends, but you know, YOLO. Are you just wanting lemon chicken, Andy? And fried rice. Please. Yeah. 50 minutes. I swear this is why I never order takeaway because it just takes so freaking long. It is pitch black outside, but we're walking to get our Chinese now. At least we're walking it's somewhat a, a pro because this kid hasn't left the house all day. So yeah, that's our little mission now. Going to get this Chinese that I so badly crave. <laughs> I ordered curry puffs. I don't even know why, because I don't even know if I've ever had one before. Or maybe we had one in like Bali once upon a time. But I have some curry puffs. We have a big old bowl of lemon chicken and a thing of fried rice. Mm -hmm. You probably had one. You probably had one like that. The good bits. <laughs> 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 This curry puff is so good. Mm -mm -mm -mm. This is my dream, having a massive shed in my backyard so I can have a little home gym. How fun would that be, Andy? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> Very nice. 
So it's been a couple hours now, if you can't tell by the fact that it's like pitch black in here right now. <laughs> it's 6pm, I've just had a shower and now I'm putting on my shoes because we're heading to our friend's house for drinks and a few board games. So that shall be a fun night. I actually just woke up from a nap, which if you know me, you know I do not nap. Are you proud, Andy? I'm proud. Every single day, Andy's like, just take a nap. You're tired. Just take a nap. And I'm like, no, I can't. Like, I physically, I try to close my eyes and I swear my brain is just too overreact, too overreactive. That too. Too overactive and I just cannot ever shut it off. So, yeah, I was watching season three of Virgin River, but I took a nap. Woke up at 6 p.m. So, this shall be interesting. I'm trying to see what time I'm going to fall asleep tonight, but... Yeah, the house hunting went well today. Obviously, just had a look-see, had a little nosy about what was around. But we'll probably keep doing that for the next few weekends just to keep an eye out on the market. But yeah, let's go to our friends. Happy Sunday. So today is reset day. So I thought I would show you guys kind of the steps I do to get me set up for a productive week ahead. So it is 11 o'clock this morning. It's quite late. But again, we just had like a bit of a slower morning. And we're about to go for a long beach walk and then we're going to do our grocery shop. It is now 2 30 p.m we just got home from doing our grocery shopping look how cute peanut is he has actually been asleep on that jacket for i'm gonna say like four hours now and it's adorable so cute but i've just made myself a coffee and i have a little snacky snack i found these at the shops today and i'm so excited they come in the little portioned out packs because otherwise i would devour these in one sitting but they're like little Cadbury biscuit finger things um yeah so I've got my laptop here I'm just in the middle of uploading a new YouTube video so I'm just making the thumbnail and then I'm also going to go through my Google calendar and plan out my week ahead I have so many calls this week so just making sure I can fit everything in and then whatever time slots I have available trying to figure out what I want to do with that time so yeah, Google Calendar is a lifesaver if you have a busy schedule or you're someone who books like a lot of appointments or calls or things like that. So handy. So I'm going to do that now. but it is now time for some self-care. I wouldn't say I do this every Sunday because honestly, half the time I forget, but I do try and have at least one evening or afternoon that's just kind of like focus more on self-care, whether it's having a bath or like laying in bed watching an episode of my TV show, just something that really kind of like unwinds me because obviously working from home and working for myself, it can get very like, overwhelming sometimes like it feels like you can never really switch off obviously a you do have to set boundaries sometimes but b i just think it's important to have those like self-care days or afternoons and stuff just to kind of unwind so i am putting on a little face mask right now i'm going to run myself a bath 